Orgonius was a native of Nicomedia, and one of the chamberlains of the emperor Diocletian, of whose sufferings the historian Eusebius hath left us an account, according to which Gorgonius and his fellow chamberlain Dorotheus, who are said to have converted the other chamber servants to believe in Christ, came one day into the presence of Diocletian and saw their fellow servant Peter undergoing torture. And the courage of his testimony roused them to protest their own faith, saying, Why, O emperor, dost thou punish this man only by condemning something which we share with him? His belief is our belief. The emperor thereupon ordered them to be bound and tortured, and their martyred bodies cast into the sea, lest they should be venerated by the Christians. Now these things happened on March 11th in the year 304. But later the body of the holy Gorgonius is believed to have been recovered and brought to Rome, and September 9th is the day upon which the translation thereof is celebrated. O Lord, hear my prayer, and let my cry come unto Thee. Let us pray. O Lord, show Thy mercy upon us, and grant us Thy salvation. O God, make clean our hearts within us, and take not Thy Holy Spirit from us. We beseech Thee, O Lord, that Thy blessed martyr Gorgonius may at all times gladden us with his intercession, and cause us ever to rejoice in the devout observance of his festival. Through Jesus Christ, thy Son, our Lord, who liveth and reigneth with thee and the Holy Ghost, ever one God, world without end. Amen. Amen.